Hi and welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Ali Hart and today I'm going to teach you how to draw a very simple human face so that you learn how to get the curve right, how to cut, <laughs> well, how to um, divide the face into different sections, plant eyes, plant nose and mouth. Obviously bear in mind that if you are drawing a face everyone's face is different but this is a really good way to get started especially if you're thinking about figure drawing or if you're thinking about just how do I make faces work this is based on symmetry really so one always matches the other and um, I am not going to use a ruler to divide the face I would encourage you to do the same I am um, you can try using a pencil to begin with I'm going to use a pen so that you can see what we are doing so the first thing to do is to do the face as if it is um, two points of a very curvy triangle and then an egg top is the way I would always explain it. So from one side you want to do one and then the other and try to get them quite similar. So another way to do that is to break it into an oval shape like this and then you separate the oval shape and you cut it in the two bits in the middle. But there we go. And then I want you to curve the top of that into the egg shape and join it up right. So there's your face to begin with. Now obviously people have sharper jaw lines, but this is our standard face. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna cut it down the middle then this way, and then we're gonna cut it horizontally as well. So straight down the middle and try to come to the point where you have at the bottom or as close to that. And then we're going to slice it through the middle. I like to curve it a little bit because eyes tend to go up at each side. So you're going to curve it right in the middle here. And take those lines all the way out. Now, obviously, if you're using a pencil, you can rub those out. And then underneath that, we're going to, you're going to divide. So this bit is where the eyes are going to be. And then we need to do nose and we need to do mouth. So we need two more lines. So now just equal amounts below here and then equal amounts again below for the mouth. Well done, it's looking good, it's looking like a mask, isn't it? So the way that I find it easiest to do is to go for the eyes first. So equal amounts on each side of this as well. You can do a point on each side and that's the beginning of the eyes. And then you can do just a very basic eye shape which is just an oval to begin with. We can go back to those after and make them a little bit more pronounced and you can have eyelash you can curve them up so that's your two eyes and now the nose as well and um, whenever you're painting nose or faces or noses you're always just implying that the light and the shade is there but for the purposes of this I want you just to imply that each side is there really of the nose and the easiest way to do it is in the cross section here just on one side you're going to indicate that the nose is there now you can make that a little bit pointier down if you want and you can put the full nose in there you can put the bridge of the nose in and then you can see that that goes up to where the um, eye is there now for the, the mouth so just below your nose and mouth this is always um, closer together than you would think so we want to get the top of the mouth in there and the easiest way to do that is to come down from the, the nose the point of the nose to the top of the lips so just do the little part of our lips here and then again you can go to the side and you can bring those out and you can make the small the lip on the bottom as small or as thick as you like and there's your basic so why don't we add in some eyeballs here so you want to put some circles like I said, in all of my pieces, it's just about breaking things into shapes and different lines. So now the eyebrows as well. The easiest way to do that is just where we had the first points for our eyes, we're going to go up and that's going to be the start of the brow. So you can do your brow whichever way you want. And the same here, we're going to go up and then your brow. People say eyebrows are like sisters, you know, rather than twins. So it doesn't matter if they're slightly varied. Can make them as big as you want so there we go that's our eyebrows eyes nose and mouth now for our ears as well so where i like to place the ears is always just between the bottom two lines so this is just where the earlobe is here and the same on the other side and then you can bring that up you can make those as obvious as you want but i'm going to put some hair in here Now, um, you can add in your hair or whatever you want. I'm going to just do like a very easy one to do if you're doing a basic shape. It's just a side shade. And the way that I like to do that is just from over the side here. And we're going to bring that across 
and bring her hair down. And then you can just raise the crown up a little bit. And then the same with over here, you want it to sit out a little bit and cover the ears and down. And then we're just going to imply where the neck is. An easy way to do it is to try, if you look at yourself here and where your mouth is, just over to the side a little bit and down, or else we can make it a little bit smaller. So I like to bring it just where the mouth is, over to the side and down. You can just imply where that neck is. But that is your basic, your basic, sorry, that is your basic face. So now what you can do is you can add in some of the eyes. You can curve the eyes. Look, we can start to add the eyelashes. We can make the um, pupils a little bit as well. You can do a little bit of eyeliner and flick out to the side. Eyelashes. Same with the lips. You can add in all your different parts. You can add in some cheekbones, which I like to do with sort of where the, the ear is coming out from the ear and down. So that's where your cheekbone is on each side here. Let's see. And the ear down. So that is your basic human face. I would love to see you give it a go. You start with your oval shape or your two points coming down and the egg head I talk about. And then we're going to cross section it. And then we put our other two lines, eyes, nose, mouth, and then your eyebrows, and then your ears, and your hair, and your neck. So I'd love to see you give it a go. Thanks for watching, and you can subscribe so you can join in on all the other demos that I have. Some are for beginner adults, some are for kids, but I'd love you to join me.